Why did you not actually move? Oh, those are... Oh, those are Eucalyptus. Those aren't, um... Thumbs of here, my sister. and Jungen. Ah, uh, welcome back to Minecraft Subtech Ages. And I am joined by... Oh, there is Tim. Hello! So, Tim's in the middle of... Crafting a gear? Yeah, need more of this um, red cedar here. I uh, got some of that, and this goes like that. And I got four buffalo teeth to go in the corner, I believe. And then we smash this with a rock, so and we got our gear. There's a gear. Ooh. Quit milling around. All right. And geared up for ratios. What have I got in my hand? What? Why have I got a book? You got a book? Yeah. Yeah, we got the uh, Megadis Journal as part of that. Um, oh, okay. So. Better with Wands is a mod that adds many new items. Blocks as well as having many features for change base function of the, of the vanilla game. This mod is broken into two um, So, mechanical power... Oh, so this is... Um, yeah, okay, so this is what adds, we got the the grindstone, which is what we're working on right now, but uh, there's various mechanical power. I don't know how much of this is added into Sevtech, mm. but this is the one that's got like the, um... Shoot, spinning wheel. Uh, it has windmills and stuff, and... Aqueducts. Scaffold, rope, bridges. Some fancy kilns and some other stuff. Yeah, I remember doing, the, um... Playing around with some of this stuff in another mod pack uh, a little bit. Um, some of it will be late. I'm guessing it's going to be for the later game. Yeah, I mean, some of it should probably come up next if it's going to be integrated. Um, okay, so it did recognize the fact that I already had one of those. So that's cool. So now I can do the... Um, can I do the crank now? Yeah. yeah. We just need sticks and some cobblestone and that gear I just made. <coughs> oh god, we also need uh... Okay, so gear. Oh, that's interesting. Cobblestone. So, the wooden axle is used to transfer continuous mechanical power in conjunction with gearbox. These wood mm -hmm. and rope devices are only able to handle three blocks in a row before breaking under the stress. This is where the gearbox come into play, allowing Junctioning and repeating the signal from the axle. Axles are also where windmills and water wheels are placed to begin creating mechanical power. What the? I'm grinding. Circle dust. No, and the uh, the hand crank like burns through your hunger meter like crazy. Mm, it does that. Yeah. Um, okay, so I got two of those. So I think I can make the flame, what? the flamey thing now. Um, yeah, this um, flame hopper. So I need some of that, and charcoal dust I just made goes there. Uh, more of these red cedar planks, which go here. Yeah, I still got cotton. And then I just need um, a shark tooth and a gem. Truck tooth, I believe, goes in the middle for reasons. I and the like gem goes on top. Opening. Flame grill goodness. Okay. And now we've got our. Uh, let's see. Porcelain heater is the next thing we need to do. And we need to make up some um, porcelain. So we need flint. Some flint, some clay, and some white dye powder um, in the millstone makes us... Which... 
that stuff. So, um, and I made up some white dye powder already. Somewhat. We have clay over here. And what else did I say? Flint? Flint. Yeah. And well, we got flint right there. Okay, cool. So, um, so put that in there and that in there. And now I can die of hunger hmm. playing with this crank. Meat and berries. What's on the floor? Oh, some of the uh, porcelain stuff. Yeah, it just kind of chucks it out onto the floor. I should probably have like a hopper. Mm. I assume maybe a hopper would work underneath. Oh, uh, you grab some of it. Uh... So, and then we need to fire this stuff up. Um, it's actually kind of interesting that they have the stone grill in here. Yeah in primal tech because um the stone grill can pretty much do what the kiln can do but better because you can put more than one yeah it kind of spots it out behind yeah it just spits it out in a random direction so so i don't know if you if like a hopper directly underneath works or if you've got to kind of like surround it and in hoppers. Right, how much do we have? I know we need at least six. Um, Alright, there's six, because I need that for that. Uh, okay, so we need twelve oh, okay. of these in total, I guess. So we just gotta keep cranking away. Excuse me. I'm gonna run out of berries. Well, I mean, the my fruit nutrition's gonna be maxed out. <laughs> yeah. Berry bushes looking. Alright, and let's see what else we got here. No, one of the buffaloes uh, growing up, one of the buffaloes is so tiny. Oh, nice. Okay, and that's 12. Sweet. <clears throat> so now we just need to make it into the brick form. Um, so we take the unfired porcelain that we just made, and we can just chuck it all on the grill, and then we'll just do its thing. So, do we need anything else? Uh, yeah, we need some... How do I make those? So we need unfired clay barrel extensions. And that is clay... That's. Let me bash it with a rock. Um, no, I think I only need to do that once because I made made two at a time. Oh well. Um, okay, and then we just need to throw these uh, in the kiln, and those look at those fired up because uh, we only need we only need two of them. So I kind of overdid that. Uh, we oh. do need another stone grill for this recipe. Um, so this is smooth stone. Do you want to make a stone grill? Okay. And then, um... Yeah, we need two 
two stone grills actually. We need a stone grill for each one of these things. Have you got the smooth stone or is it in here? Uh, should be some smooth stone in there, I think. Ah, got some. Three rocks and three stone blocks. Uh, where did I put the rocks? There. No, I'm done. Right. Did I not? No, I didn't. Stone can go. Where can stone go? There, next to the flint. And then crafting rock. Okay, I've got the two stone grills. Do you want them? Yep. Check them my way, sir. Thanks, sir. Both. Okay, so one of them goes here, and this will, that's right, yeah, because we need the heater and then the melter, okay. Melter. Yes, yeah, so I've melt the base. And then more of the porcelain bricks. There we go. One of those there. One of these here, and we put a chest on the bottom. Boom! Welcome back out of age zero. We've gotten to the first age! <laughs> Finally. And we got a new tab on our achievements. Materials and you. Fun. <clears throat> oh my god. So that was age zero. Mm. This is age one. Okay. Welcome to the next age. I Blocks previously know. hidden will now become visible, such as ore samples and others. Okay, so does that mean we can go mining? Mm hmm. And then, let's see. So, what, what do we have in this? So, we've got aqueducts. Move water using aqueduct by creating a channel with the aqueduct on the bottom and any block on the sides creating a V-shape. Note, this advancement requires that you place the block uh, to complete it. Okay. And then bottom bar clay barrels can hold fluids such as water or li uh, or liquid metals. Um, if you need to find hostile mobs, use the hunting dimension. Craft the portal frame just like you would the nether portal, light it using a vanilla sword, and sneak in the portal to enter. Okay. Uh, stirring the pot, looking for a more efficient way to make leather or dough? Yeah. Craft the <laughs> the wooden basin. Fill it with a cracked liquid and items, then stir. Oh, that sounds exciting. A better mm. way of making leather. Oof. Oof. That's exciting. Follow my channel, please. A channel's a great way to transport liquids from tanks and other sources when placing down a channel. Follow the arrow on top. 
right click to change, directions, disconnect, etc. Pour liquids into the channel using the normal porcelain faucet. Alright, yeah, so that's for uh, uh, melting. Oh, we can finally get a regular crafting table as well. Craft a regular table. <gasps> ah. Oh, that's exciting. Um, oh, God. Could they not afford now, a better name for the anvil? Oh, we can get a hole, though. So that... Holy crap. I'm amazed. What? They didn't even change the recipe on this. Did they not? No, it's just four planks. <laughs> like I thought for shit sure they would have changed the recipe on this, made it a little at least a little bit more complicated, but no, it's still four planks. Alright. Oh, a regular crafting table. <gasps> so oh, that, exciting. Does that mean we can Uh, can we can we make regular chests too? Not entirely sure. Yes, but no. Oh no, that's the same. Can I? So can I just do this? Yeah. <laughs> Bam! Oh my God, regular chest! So exciting. <laughs> well, that's gonna be handy. Um. It's like we've started. It's like we reached the level of of playing vanilla Minecraft. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought I'd be excited to make a freaking wooden chest. So. Okay. Okay. Now here's the other thought. Like we talked earlier about. Um, I mentioned the idea of kind of like keeping structures per age. Mm -hmm. Um, so I guess the question mark is, do we want to, like, look into maybe, like, now that we can build all sorts of new stuff that's far better, a lot of this stuff is now just legacy. Um, do we want to... Do we want to move, or do we... Move? So, because this is, because this would be our like age zero base, and then we just move and start an age one base. Man, we could do. Um, I'm not against that because I kind of like the idea of like you know, advancement, like leaving this as like a museum to mm. all the crap we had to do. I mean, obviously we'll take um, you know various things with us in terms of some raw materials and other things but yeah. um but uh but this gives us a real leg up because yeah we'll be able to yeah because we can make um we can make doors yay <gasps> finally <laughs> wonder if that's changed the village just then terms of their building maybe maybe because it did say um that it opened up like it un uh unhides things that were hidden mm. so maybe they just had like hidden doors and like now magically they have doors well so but maybe not they might you know given that that's just part of um part of world gen um what I might do is actually <sighs> see. Um, oh, we can also make regular torches now. Oh, that's good. Um, so that's a thing as well. Um, cool that we already made a couple of advancements. Um, oh, we got dowsing rods apparently to help us locate ore. Dowsing rods or dowling rods? Oh, dowsing. Are they called? called dowsing rods. Okay. So. Um. How do we get dowsing rod? My backpack is full of food. Super duper cheap. Okay. 
Uh, have we got any? Well, I might as well. I might as well take that. I might as well take them. <coughs> I take it we're going to still need corn seeds. Is it? You've got your shears, haven't you? I'm just wondering, is it worth? Uh, I'm just gonna chuck. Um, okay, uh, hold on to that. Um, let me have a look. Sir. Can we actually make a? <laughs> ah, okay. We what? might. We still may need either to take our TPs with us, or we make some new ones. We don't have proper beds yet. Yeah, we can make strong leaves. <laughs> yeah, which oh, we need a whole bunch of wheat. Well, we've got plant. We've got some wheat down at the fire, down at the river. Yeah, and we do have plenty of bone meal if we wanted to just grow mm. a whole bunch. Um, so, because we've got two stacks of bone meal, we'll need our rafts if we're. Um, Disappearing. It's kind of worth probably yeah. taking. We have boats yet? No, we don't have no. boats. Um, it's kind of worth me taking my saddle. It's probably worth you getting your saddle. Yeah, well, my saddle's on my horse, so. I ain't got a horse yet. So, have... no, you can feel free to break this other one. Um, yeah. We got another lead. So, oh, we also unlocked uh, Wayla. We unlocked uh, the uh, the tooltips. So when you mouse over a block, it says what it uh, mm -hmm. what it is up top. Yeah, kind of noticed that. Oh man, I've missed that. Um, now we still don't have journey map. No. Um, we still have the book. Yeah, which is fine. I mean, we have a map. We're fine with that for now. Um, what I might do is actually, if we are moving, I'm going to rename... Can I rename? Uh, no, I'd have to delete that marker. Add the marker to there. And put that down here as home page zero. So that this is our starter base. Yeah, we've got wheat. Um, just trying to think of anything else. Have we got? Oh yeah, okay. It's quite handy. Then I'm not having to. We might need the ink sacks. Just wondering if we've got. Oh, we can make a. Um... No. Yeah, we can make a hoe now. Yeah, that's why I'm. Um... Yeah, we don't need to deal with the um, farmland, the farm, farmland soil stuff. Um, Which is question one. though is whether or not we can move water or not. We do have. Um... Oh, so the turn tape. Oh, okay. So we'll need to do that. Okay, that's gonna be a little bit of yeah, work. Know. But but we do have the clay buckets. Um. Yeah, we do. But um. We'll yeah, we'll have to get we have to get some mechanical power working first though, because we have to make the unfired clay barrel extension, put it on a turntable, and then um. That'll make an unfired clay bucket, and then we can mm. smelt that, and then that'll make a clay bucket. But we do have a path of progression to being able to move water around, which is good. Um, <sighs> just trying to get a sense of what we might have 
or what we do have available to us. Plumbing the depths, use a plumb line to discover your Y level. But we have aqueducts. Yeah, that can move water around, so I just, I don't know exactly how that works. Use a dung pipe to pull items out of a block. Or use as a sewer pipe to pull through solid block. Mm. Bottom of the barrel extensions. Uh. Alright. Um, Alright. The thing is, though, is if we're moving, we need to figure out where we're moving to. Two. Um, um, so that's, I think, kind of question number one here. Um, so how do you tame the animal again? So take them off the lead. So just uh, right click with an empty hand to grab the, the lead from the um, grindstone. Yeah, okay. I guess you can keep on the. You can try and keep them on the lead too. Um, you can tr j just try keep uh, keep riding them. You'll get kicked off a bunch of times. Just keep riding them until finally see like hearts. Come here. Did you tame yours with apples or anything? I mean, technically I fed mine apples, but in my single player on this, I didn't even bother with that. I just kept riding them until finally I got hearts. <clears throat> Why do I have to get the awkward horse? Got a heart there. I'm guessing I got a heart there. Alright. Yeah, try right clicking on him and then, um. Or no, uh, hit. Wait, what are you doing? Yeah, right click with the saddle. Yeah, okay, there you go. Yeah, okay. We can stand the blade for cool. now. Um. Are we actually. Okay, let's go. So let's, um. Well, now I put mine back. Uh, because, yeah, we need to. What else do we need? Do that. Um, let's see, do we need anything else? Well, we need obviously. Oh yeah, that's right. I was gonna look at. Um, yeah. So we can make uh, fences now. Wow. Hmm. Um, and uh, out of habit, I, 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 I almost was like, oh, okay, boop, 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 working on the freaking stone stump again. Um, okay, so fence. Here you go, his fence. Um, I take a fence. When we travel, uh, if we need to stop anywhere, um, obviously the fence is good for a hitching post. Mm hmm. Um, so that means we should also be able to make, uh, fence gates, yeah, um, I still take a fence. which means we can put some fence gates around. Litigated matter. How many more puns are you going to come up with? Well, fence gates would be a lot easier than having to pilot a Oh my goodness. Look how beautiful. <laughs> it's a thing of beauty. Definitely. Fence gate. Isn't that exciting? Yeah. 
We just, I'm excited. We just, um... What's the plan? You want to go north or you want to more go towards like the meadow, open south, so south -y. or east, um, or west? I don't know. You got any thoughts? Well, let me take a look in the book. We haven't really, we've gone north obviously, because a tiny outpost. We've got village one to the north home where we are and then we've got that village we haven't really gone because we know i know where the village is south there's water we haven't really gone east have we that's uh no i am my only my only consideration mm. is whether or not we want to be uh closer to the dark lands So, because if there's anything more that we need from the Darklands. Travel to the bottom of Beneath Dimension to find Black Quartz. Uh, so, because some new recipes did open up um, using, like, gems and stuff. Uh, Abyssal Trophy Curse. Dark, oh, God. Dark Rituals. Oh, Jesus Christ. So, yeah, because there's, like, Necronomicon rituals and stuff, but yeah, I don't know if that's... I'm kind of guessing the neck, The neck, Yeah, that word? Necronomicon. Yeah. Find a Shagoth lair in the swamp and river biomes. After six or more yeah. spawn... Uh, do you reckon that the Cthulhu creatures are them necronomicon? Them yeah, things. yeah, they're yeah, Shragoths, yeah, yeah, that's what those are. <laughs> so, um, <clears throat> but I mean, we'll be able to make some better stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I mean, it's all I'm sure going to be a challenge, but, um, but, uh, but we'll be able to make some some better stuff. Um, but yeah, so we need to make the Necronomicon at some point, and yeah, there is some more like Abyssal Craft stuff that leads through to the end because our last thing um, at the end of this one is linked to the stars which is complete the ritual to transform a crafting table into the luminous crafting table hmm. um, so in order to do that we're going to have to find one of those um, shrines uh, what kind of the name of that mod? I don't even remember the name of the mod but uh, we have to find a, a shrine thing but that's, that's going to be wild sorcery, that'd be yeah cool. that's, that's the one good job <laughs> it's got so. Uh, yeah, I couldn't. I w my brain was nowhere close to thinking of the name of that. Um... Oh, that's funny. The clay, the clay bucket is actually like the the thing on the very far right. Hmm. <laughs> uh, that's hilarious. Um. All right, but yeah, we got a bunch of other stuff to do. This stuff, locate, mine coal, mm -hmm. find cassiterite or teolite surface Oof. sample, and dig for tin. The ore is located between Y8 and Y68. No yeah, but... surface samples will unhide uh, in already explored areas. But to do that. Where, which one was that one? The tin one. That's uh, error four hundred four. Heart not found. Um, it's right after prospecting uh, yeah. to make the dowsing rod. Mm. Uh, the dowsing rod's cheap to make. So um, what? But anyway, yeah, we need to figure out where we're going to be. So um, we need to figure out where we're going to be. We're also going to need, obviously, um, like building materials. Um, but um, but it looks like a craft is still somewhere in our future, so we might want to be we might still want to have access to the um, to the darklands. Mm -hmm. But we might have to go on foot. Um, Just I mean, we've got like I say, we've got all our 
Darklands wood and stuff still here. I'm just thinking if you want to be Yeah, but if we need more of those gems, we're going to have to kill more creatures, mm -hmm. is my point. You know what I mean? Now, we can use the lead to bring the uh, horses across water. Um, and I have a mark where the where the cows were um, to kind of like the east. There's a, looks like a little bit of a river there, but there's more land right on the other side. I'd like to see just how much land there is between here and the Darklands. So, I mean, I'll, um, I think I grabbed my raft, didn't I? I no, thought I grabbed it. There's still two rafts here. Yeah, huh. I thought I grabbed my raft. Um, well, I was going to go by horse first to see just how, how much land there is. Mm -hmm. Um, so, and like I said, we can use the lead to get the, um, to drag the horses across water. Um... How do I... So, and actually, before we go, I'm going to... I need to dump out my inventory a bit, I think. Because um, I figure we'll, we'll come back here once we've kind of made some sort of decision. Um, and stock up on... Uh... Duff. One second, just let me... Uh... Well... Yeah, what I might as well what I might as well do for quick easy access. Oh yeah, what what am I friggin' derping about, huh? Well No, we get we we have real chests now. Sitting here friggin' putting shit in. Yeah, I'm just gonna make myself a little chest and just dump do what you're doing here and just dump all my crap in here that I don't most specifically need at the moment. Most of it is just like food. Um, see, I do need my lead. Um, I need to get my lead I off. A bunch of those. Uh, what do we have for food? Quite a lot. Alright, because I need a little bit of food. Yeah, I'll need some food myself. Um, um, so I'll bring that, and then is there anything else I need? I oh, yeah, I need... Yeah, make sure to bring your sleeping mat. Um, oh, yeah, I've got... I've got my sleeping mat. Okay, yeah, and... My fence post. Yeah, I've got my fence post. Okay, um... Yeah, so I get a lead, my sleeping mat, fence post raft, uh, which... Which not really applicable this time around, but, um... I forget a, and, I forget oh, yeah, I'm gonna bring some... Cobblestone for repairing um, tools uh, in case that's needed. Grab some pot chops just in case I get some some mutton. Should be enough food. 